Hello, my dear friends. Today, Breaking Brain and movie Happy Girl Lucky. But sometimes we are going to the cinema, and after this movie, sometimes we are unhappy and unlucky. And when you disagree about something with your friends or with another people, do you try still talk and explain your point of view, or maybe you just think? Just go away and leave me alone. Today, I want to tell you something about Clarify. Clarify is a few easy steps how we can change our mindset and talk with another people in a good way. Clarify is a great idea from article by Alana Conner. The letters in Clarify stand for Check your motives. Listen. Ask. Repeat. Use I statements. Find common ground and use yet mindset. And right now, I want you to tell you something more about every steps. Number one. Check your motives. Why do you want to have conversation with this person? If your intention is to change their mind, humiliate them or show them that they are wrong, then please avoid the talk. Because in this case, you and your conversation partner will likely be so focused on defending. And Instead, approach your conversation as an anthropologist trying to understand someone deeply different than you. Who is this person? Why do they think, feel, believe, value and act the way they do? And remember, without judgment. And number two, listen carefully. Aim to understand what the speaker means and feels, not just the words they are using. Paying close attention shows respect, which is the foundation of learning from each other. And number three, ask open-ended questions. For example, how does that make you feel? Why do you think you react that way? How do you reach that conclusion? Asking open-ended questions will not only help you better understand the other person's perspective, but also demonstrate your genuine interest in exchanging information, not just winning your point. Number four, repeat what the person has said, because it's your interpretation what you understand, what is really mean. And for example, you can use this question or phrase. So what I hear you saying is, or I'm sensing that you feel, or let me make sure I understand you believe that. For example, it's not easy because in our head we have so many thoughts, we have so many opinions and we have our own idea what another people talk to us. But sometimes we are wrong. Okay, and next, number five. Use I statements to express your thoughts, feelings and values without attacks on the other person. It's so important. This I phrase include I feel, I believe, I think, I have read and I learned. Because you know, sometimes we have more than only one true story. Number six, find common ground. What does this mean? Try to find something good in person next to you. 
For example, you can set I sense we share the desire to do what is right or I appreciate your honesty. It's really easy because you know nobody is perfect. Okay, tell me, are you still with me? Right now, number seven, adopt a yet mindset. You know, be an optimist. Not yet. You may not understand each other yet, but keep talking and listening. You have possibility to build your bridge and still talk together. Right now, my friends, it's your turn. Please practice your cross-cultural conversation skills and try to talk with another people from different country, different culture, without bias. Thank you so much. Take care and be safe. See you next time. Bye.